In an era where aerial threats evolve rapidly, India's defense mechanisms have adapted to ensure national security. At the forefront of this evolution stands the S-400 Triumph missile system, known in India as the Sudarshan Chakra. This advanced air defense system symbolizes precision and swift retaliation, akin to the mythological weapon of Lord Vishnu. The S-400 Sudarshan Chakra is a long-range surface-to-air missile system developed by Russia's Almaz Ante and procured by India to bolster its air defense capabilities. Capable of detecting and engaging multiple aerial targets, including aircraft, drones and ballistic missiles, this system can track threats up to 600 kilometers away and neutralize them within a 400 kilometer range. Its integration into India's Integrated Air Command and Control System IACS, ensures real-time threat assessment and response. Since its induction in 2021, the S-400 has been strategically deployed across various regions in India, including the northern and western sectors. These deployments aim to safeguard critical infrastructure and population centers from potential aerial threats. In May 2025, during heightened tensions with Pakistan, the Sudarshan Chakra demonstrated its operational prowess. On the night of May 7th to 8th, Pakistan launched a coordinated drone and missile attack targeting 15 Indian cities. The S-400 system successfully intercepted and neutralized these threats, preventing potential casualties and infrastructure damage. Defense analysts have lauded the S-400's performance, emphasizing its role in establishing a multi-layered air defense network. By complementing indigenous systems like Akash and Israeli origin systems, the Sudarshan Chakra enhances India's ability to counter diverse aerial threats. The S-400 Sudarshan Chakra stands as a testament to India's commitment to national security and technological advancement. As aerial threats continue to evolve, systems like the Sudarshan Chakra ensure that India remains prepared to defend its skies with precision and resilience.